Okay, I got Jose <laughs> PhD and Gears parking OCD. They're parking parking OCD style. I like that. Here's the next step. This is what you call a parking OCD victory. When you go back to your car and no one's parked next to you, that's the victory. That's that's the game. That's why you do it. And it looks like I'm good. There I am, right there. I win two spots. This red truck wasn't here earlier. And that black one was there. So one, two, three, four spots over. One, two, still two spots over safe. That red truck wasn't there, so I was three over, three spots over safe when I got here. I'll upload this video tomorrow. Now I have turned the camera properly for that one. Now my car has all the scorpions. All right, today's video. Unacceptable parking spots. So I'm at Albertson right now. I actually don't want to be at Albertson's right now. But there's no acceptable parking spots where I want to go. Sprouts right there. So just like a continuation about car OCD parking far you get exercise too you get exercise when you are into your car so you get a nice little walk okay I'll show you guys what unacceptable parking looks like it's exercise man yeah, see, this ain't gonna work. You need at least, like, two spots over. I don't like parking next to other cars. See, this ain't working, man. Unacceptable. I don't know, maybe I'm the only one like this. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's cut through. You get the idea. Well, there's some spots now, but when I went around earlier, there was like no gaps, still still not enough gaps. That's my opinion. So yeah. So I had to park across the street. Yeah, I don't want a shopping cart hitting my car. That's lame, man. That's lame. New Edge Mustang. Nice, nice condition. That's good. There's a van. A lot of you guys like vans, so that's a nice van right there. Some, uh, some old pickup. Dodge. They all look the same. All pickup from that era look the same to me. Here's my health food, right here. I don't know, this is like a checking in video. Been busy lately. Getting as much overtime as possible. Just running errands. I've been more into the gym lately. Got my friend like really into the gym, so, you know, it's good stuff. Consistently going. That's why I decided to go like completely off sweets like five weeks ago. Because my best friend came down from from uh, Germany. We went to high school together though. I've known him since junior high actually. So he came down. We got into the gym. Then my other friend got into the gym too. So 
Last five weeks, man. No dessert at all. No soda. And it was like eight pounds, man. Eight pounds of fat that I lost. I could tell, man, I had to buy a new belt. So there's a health tip for you guys if you're into eating right. Honestly, I wish I wasn't into that shit. I'd rather be like 500 pounds, man, and like eat pizza and hamburgers all day long, but just not my thing. See, nobody parked right next to me. Just how I like it.